this camp, now that it's taking reps, how's it going? <clears throat> it's good. You know, it's good to be back on the field. Um, you know, out here today was my first time with the pads on, so it's good to get the feel of it before we start, like, the regular season. You kind of passed that stage where you're thinking about, you know, anything and you just... Yeah, Ken! <laughs> yeah, I'm comfortable. Yeah, I'm comfortable with everything now. Um, yeah, I feel good. It's a big difference between year one and year two. I know they said that a lot, but like, I was like, I kind of didn't believe it, but like, I'm real comfortable now. I don't have to think as much. It's like, it's coming easier to me now. Where's your biggest growth been? Um, what you mean, like play-wise? Yeah. Like, um, I feel like just, like I just talked about, like playing comfortable, you know? I feel like I had to get in a lot of games to do that, but since I've played in a, a lot of games, I feel like I'm more comfortable now. And I feel like that's where the growth came in. How about um, Getting in a routine and things. You know, learning how to really take care of my body. You know, I thought I was taking care of my body, but really wasn't. But like now, I talked to Bobby or, you know, the strength staff, and they helped me out on like what to do. Like, and they helped me find a routine on like how to take care of my body the right way. Do you not eat things you used to eat in college? No, 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 not at all. I used to eat cereal all the time in college, but I had to cut that out. So, yeah, I cut out a lot of things that I used to eat, and I feel much better now. Why did you doubt that there would be a big difference between year one and year two? Um, Because I feel like that's, like, such a short time. Like, well, it felt like a short time, but, I mean, when we came back in OTAs and uh, started training camp, everything was smooth. So, yeah, I'm real comfortable now. I know you haven't been on the field as much with Drew, but what have you seen from Drew and the way that he's approached camp and the games? Um, he's been doing great. You know, he's a great leader. Um, he soak up everything, you know, that goes on in that QB room. And he's smart and he knows he knows his plays and he, he knows ball. Last year, obviously, like Rashad was here and things like that. Do you feel sort of like the leader of the running back room now? Or like um, yeah, um, like, yeah, I do. Um, I feel like I kind of feel how Penny feel now about me. You know, he always wanted to see me do good. And so, you know, how Zach got here and K Mac got here, I always want to see them do good and help them in the best way I can. Did the time you missed that not, not practicing, I mean, I guess it doesn't matter at all? Or were you still able to get a lot of work done by the season? Oh, I was able to get a lot of work. I've been working since camp started. So I've been able to do a lot of work, like behind the scenes, like you said. Yeah, he's great, you know. Um, he came in and it seemed like he was like, you know, he's on top of everything. You know, he knows his plays, he knows what to do, and he runs hard, and that's exciting. You know, he get me excited when I see him run. And, you know, I'm excited I'm excited for this season to see what he does. What about his style? What, I mean, what, like when you watch him, mm -hmm. what is it about his style? He, he runs physical and aggressive. You know, he runs mad, so it's exciting, you know, especially in that Vikings game. You got the, y'all got the chance to see, like, what he was really about. Is that different than the way you would run? Um, yeah, I feel I run mad, but I feel like yeah, I mean, <laughs> I run mad. I, I feel like I don't know. I got different. I just let other people say how I run. I don't know how I would explain myself. What's been your impression of Bobo? He's making plays. He's making plays. Everybody sees it. You know, um, we got this thing. We say more Bobo. You know, give him the ball. You know, he always gonna make a play. What are your expectations for the team this season? Um. You know, I expect us to go far. Uh, we got a team, we got the people and plays to do it. I feel like we just got to execute and uh, take it one game at a time. You see a difference in Gino this year? Yeah. Um, I mean, well, he's consistent. He's a leader. Um, he knows the game. Uh, I feel like Gino is Gino. You know, he's, like I said, he's a great leader. Thought at all on sort of the debate that there is in the NFL about sort of the value of running backs and the way the contract situations are done and stuff like that. Do I have a thought? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I feel like we not appreciate it, you know, but that's how it is. I mean, I can't complain about it. I just got to keep coming and doing my job. You had the groin thing early in camp. How are you feeling in terms of 80 to 90, 100 percent? Yeah, I'm feeling good. You know, um, you know, I was out here today and I felt good. And I've been running, like I said, behind the scenes, so I've been feeling good. Are you enjoying yourself more? Because you, you smiled more in this interview than last year. I mean, mm -hmm. you kind of press in enjoying yourself in terms of this process yeah. now? Yeah, especially when you, like, know what's going on, you know, when you got other stuff going on. Like, if I'm um, not really, I'm not going to say I don't know what I'm doing, but, like, when it's a lot of things going on when I, my rookie year, and then, like, now I know everything. So 
Yeah, I will say. I'm expecting to be more funny, tell jokes, but that's not you. Nah, I'm chilling. I ain't gonna tell no jokes. <laughs> Anything else? Good. Thank you.